I was instructed that you were going to do the welcome, sir. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. To God be the glory. Greetings, yes, God. So lovely this word that he gave us, his one and only son. He gave me his life and I told him for sin. And thanks be to God. He opened the life gates. And all of the return. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise his wonderful name. As I am called upon to do the welcome, I do so in the mighty name of Jesus. The psalmist David says, I want to be a God keeper in the house of my God and to dwell in the tents of forgive men. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. First, I want everyone to help me to greet the blessed Holy Spirit. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. As you can see, someone said this is a Holy Ghost church. Praise the Lord. And we can see and feel the presence of God in this house. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Then to our esteemed Bishop. Bishop Jesus. Praise the Lord. To our old pastor. Pastor I just say, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. So I leave them, we can not God. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord to our evangelists, to find the stuff. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. To our missionaries, the missionary families, to our prayers, to our prayers. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. To our superintendent. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord to our secretary, praise the Lord. Our musical choir, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord to the musicians. And you can see that they are being led for money. Praise the Lord to the lovely son of Abraham. And that is worshiping for money. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. And with the children, praise the Lord. For visitors, regular visitors, and I think I recognize that face down there. Praise the Lord. Um, I think that's um, Brother Nico's wife. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Minister Ross. Praise the Lord. 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 And to all the other visitors. Praise the Lord. Feel free to worship. It is liberty all. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise his wonderful name. So, on behalf of the General Assembly and Church of the First Line, which is bringing in heaven, we welcome you all in the mighty and precious name of Jesus Christ. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Brother Dave, for that wonderful welcome. Praise the Lord. You know, it was my pleasure to have served you today. I hope something that I would have said would have, you know, resonated with you. We will now have the choir given their rendition of the Usher's will collect the day's offering, after which the next Voice over here is that of our deacon, Deacon K. Macon. God bless you all in Jesus' name. Right.
praise the Lord. That's his name. Praise his name. Let's pray the Lord as we go to the Lord. So I hope that it will be a blessing to each and every one of us hearts. Praise the name of the Lord. The blood that Jesus shed for me.
If you leave your bread and my feet, he will cleanse us. He doesn't cleanse us of leprosy and our child of disease. When he went down, he had us. He left and he went to the disciples. And when Lazarus was sick, I didn't come to the show. He didn't show. Until I think four days time, when he said to the disciples that they were going back, they could never believe him. But Jesus is about his coming. When you pray, you wait and you see the reward. He didn't want to go back to the disciples because the promise that he was told him by the way there before. But this time when he went back and he wept, I think, three times. And he asked the question, where did he lay? And he called by name, you know, I have bodies in the grave here. It's all by name, it's a whole way of stone. It's another one spoke to it. Another one came up, and then made a change. So the village, but I don't want to leave by him. But no, he can't leave by him. So I'm not going to ask you to cover us when we go home or something. We ask you, Lord, 
la France est en os. Le rôle sinon, le pretender, vous nous l'avez signé. Le père de la vie, il dit dans le corps, quand il est venu à la yorka, le corps de la vie, il est venu à la yorka, 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 No respect of life, the heart of many will or lots to go. No love, no unity. So I'm saying this afternoon, I'm passing the Lord to the Lord of God in the name of Jesus, to have mercy upon us and to bless the church, bless our leaders, bless our congregation, and have mercy upon us. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. You know, I want to do anything. You 
with the best friends and all. Before I'm going to get into the preacher, I'm just going to ask my bishop for my meditation. Just say, praise the Lord, praise God. Yeah, just two things I like to say to the church. First of all, I'm going to like to the preacher for today. But this morning, I came up to the South gentleman come here. I know this operator taxi, and he was seen at the car yesterday, but he didn't see me, and we passed the prayer for me. So, but he said to me this morning that when he come, when he look around, he see that it's a different thing from what he was thinking of. And this place will be his, uh, Place of worship. So I do not know what I have to say. I'm going to say this. Go look at that little part. Call her a sister there. And what I call her, because she said, because she was born. She wanted to be a doctor. She was born in the Middle East, the Seventh-day Adventist, her mother, the Seventh-day Adventist. A while ago, she said to me, she wanted to be baptized, so I said, I have to get to the class. She said, she wanted to be baptized now, so I don't know. Uh, you know, to get out of the class, to uh, ask her to speak to the mother and father because she's on the age. So before, I'm like you, what is your opinion today? I'm sad. You. Because talk to you, I met more than some of you. So this is my company over there, Thank you. 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 I will continue serving my Lord. This time, because setting the limit of my hands in the place of worship. Two places of worship. I see the mutual thing. I see the power of leader that can be in the right part of the world. So I'm going to ask the children to trust the prayer that's straight up. I know it's not music, but it's in my heart. In my heart, it's in my heart. 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 Thank you. 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 This place should be on fire. Praise to God for that. I don't know why I should be. I said to the praise the name of the Lord. Because, let me tell you something. God is doing it anywhere. We were here in Wednesday, and um, Sister Violet's here is a good shepherd, and I said, and the food became a bright. I saw a young lady come and then she sit there, but I knew this in prime time, she caught her hair. So I had to get her on to her. So when I realize, I know even our great grandmother was moving out of the bar, not my publisher, and not my mother named Dawn. I always pray for her, God, for from the family until the grandmother becomes a Jehovah witness. So I'll tell you, God has been over, and I know that she's sick. So I called her and asked her, where should we he said, God, my tongue and she, and God is all one another. And she said that she is the member of the Pentecostal Church from Pastor Gibbs. She baptized her, she was 50 years of age, and now she's 25. And I invited her to the weekend revival coming up, and she said that she be here. And so far, we see that she's looking very interesting. 
and say to our Lord, we have time in Jesus' name, we live in the Holy Ghost, but we believe in the commandments in the Holy Spirit. God is bringing in his people. So what we are to do when you come, and come with him, and give him the word of God. Praise Thank you, Lord. 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 We have to pray more. We have to continue to pray more. I pray straight up. And ask God to keep him. Ask God to cover him. You know, because many churches don't have a pastor, a bishop, like our bishop. You know, so I will give God thanks for him. And continue to ask God to pray. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I'm just asking the one that was supposed to um, testify and. Um, Exalt and admonish the church, you know, with because of to the time spent with us, what the focus was all of these things, but we can't focus on the preacher. We have to hear the word of God, and the word of God is not going to keep us, and that is what going to carry us. So, you know, before the preacher come, I just want to say, if I just stop soon, she's a woman that takes our word very serious. She don't joke about her work. She love to see the soul of men. Because she loves the sweat when I travel here. She loves the sweat when I see God. And when I go to war, we can't tell you. She always has some encouraging words to give you. And she says, oh, I need it. And I tell you, I wish she had done with pastor. She says, she had done. No matter what she had done when I go to war. She never gave nobody to touch me. I'll give something to you. Praise the Lord, sir. Praise the Lord. You know, I'm, 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 going, to go, I'm going to try to go to our life story. We're not children and everybody. But because every one of us in here is our children. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I'm going to go speak to our father. Our father is not the children. Praise the Lord. You know, the love one, even though sometimes they get the shoe and the love, broke this away. But no matter what, we still love one. We have always love one. You know, we give that chance for you. You know, because many times she's not going to be with me. I should find it to be able to be here with us and to share the word of God with us. Praise the Lord, church. Praise the Lord, church. Praise the Lord, church. You know, I just want everybody to know the sun. Everybody. Everybody. The sun knows that. You know? No. You know, make sure what we don't hear here. Go to God. This is my mother. From my mother. And it's a lovely lady. I should love each and everyone of us. Please let me let us know the word of God. Let us know where she comes and she gives the word. She teaches you. She takes out of you. She gives you things that she knows the word of God to us. Pray to God. No one wants to give a call of God. Or we find it. Oh. 
they are taking the word of God to a different dimension. Praise the name of the Lord. Because they are so highly educated, they have been to the highest theological schools, they can pronounce their TH, they can do their S's properly, the past tense, the present tense, the past part is people that sometimes when you listen to them, my God. But I am a humble servant of God. I was taught at the feet of Jesus. Praise the name of Jesus. Praise the name of Jesus. Praise the name of Jesus. I'm going to call on two persons to stand to read the scriptures. But before I open my mouth, I want to be consecrated. Father God, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, one more time, these earthen vessels come before you. Consume me right now, Lord. Take me out of myself right now. Make me a vessel of honor right now. Jump that cord from your heart right now. Let it not be about me today, Lord, but let it be about you today. Anoint me from the crown of my head to the soul of my very feet. And as I open my mouth today, let self be slain and you be exalted. And I tell you, thanks. In Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the name of Jesus. Praise the Lord. I'm going to call on Sister Bass to come forward. And you are going to turn your Bible with me to Ozia for. Call and Sister Joy Davis to come also. And we are going to look at Isaiah 24, 1 to 5. Sister Barnes, and I'm going to ask for some pray people here. Praise the name of the Lord. If I'm too high, Lord, bring me down. I'm going to ask past Bishop and Pastor to give me the permission to go a little low. Is it being granted? And the paper makes some jottings. I'm going to ask for, for your prayers. Continue to pray for me. I won't be long with you. Praise the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. Thank you, Deacon. Hosea 4 and verse 1. And Isaiah 24, 1 to 5. Premium church. Church premium. Church premium. Praise the name of Jesus. My topic today, the door of mercy is about to close. Hallelujah. 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 Can you repeat it? The door of mercy is about to close. I said, Lord, after you gave me these scriptures, I said, God, what's the topic? So when a topic run through my head, I said, Lord, speak to me. And it was just last night, he gave me the response. Pray me, our church, my bishop, pray for me. I'm going to ask the 
first reader? Praise the Lord. Isaiah 24, verses 1 through 5. Behold, the Lord make the earth empty and make it to waste and turn it into upside down and scatter it abroad in habitants thereof. And it shall be as with the people, so with the priests, as with the servants, so with which is made, as with the maid, so with her mistress. As with the buyer, so with the seller. As with the lender, so with the borrower. As with the taker of usury, so with the giver of usury to him. The land shall be utterly empty and utterly spoiled, for the Lord hath spoken this word. The earth mourneth and fadeth away. The world languisheth and fadeth away. The outer people of the earth will languish. This and last. The earth also is defiled under the inhabitants thereof, because they have transgressed the laws, changed the ordinance, broken the everlasting covenant. Sister Banks, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Glory to God. When we look in our world today, we can see signs that are written herein. We look at Parliament. We look at the government. We look in the school rooms. We look all over society. We look at in at land across the waters. We look four corners of the earth. And then we come back. Last but not least, we look at the church. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. So many things are happening today. Mankind, they are seeking solution to the many problems. Glory to God. Because when we look at the metallic image in Daniel, we see we are all the kingdoms of the earth. They have been cast down until the four kingdoms. We are at the four kingdoms right now. We are iron and clay. Cannot mix. Wow. Covenant is an agreement we said. Yes. Amen? Yes. Conditional promises made to human by God. It's an agreement. Yes, yes. And when we look at covenant, it's almost the same thing. What happened? God made an agreement with man from the 
garden of Eden. If you do what is right, there will be no trouble. But once you go against my agreement, there is going to be trouble. And I want to look at verse 5 in Isaiah. He said, Man, I'll do what? Change the ordinances. Or Zion. Which one of them? Come on, give it to me. And they have broken the everlasting covenant. Praise the name of Jesus. Praise the name of Jesus. God laid it down. And then when we look at his fools today, what is happening? They don't want Jesus in the school anymore. We used to have devotion. And we, we say our oh, oh, father prayer. They don't want that anymore. Because they don't want their boys and girls to be indoctrinated by any religion. Praise the name of the Lord. What is happening? When we look at our national we see God was in the picture. He turned our father place to one another. What is happening today? Things have changed. And they have changed severely. What are we going to do? Because we think it is going to be things. But we are in the end of time. Our door is about to close. Changing the ordinance. What God laid down from the beginning. It goes into eternity. Why may think to change times and laws? Man can go in and do it in your own thing. Hallelujah. 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 Corruption everywhere. Blood everywhere. When
we have been punished by the commandment. What the commandment laid down for dear is a problem with the servant. Hallelujah. Away with the servant. Ten. Ten. God gives to us. But we feel to hopeless nine of them. Or oh, we need to keep nine of them. But one is given problem today. Glory to God. Glory to God. But the church won't back down. Glory to God. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And when I look 
was burnt. They lived on her breast was badly burnt. And she was burnt all over. What is happening? Hallelujah. A father molesting the daughter. A stepfather molesting. Family member doing some molesting. Not even to the teenager. But some babies. What is that name? You don't have to do anybody anything these days. You are being called down. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You are afraid to talk these days because you're free and for your life. It doesn't matter how you put on. Do is right. 
the church in our Jesus party. You ever hear say Jesus have any party? Read the Bible two and two. You ever hear say Jesus have any party? Jesus go from one place to the other. Do you want? Preaching, healing, hallelujah, teaching. Hallelujah. This is not sin. A little righteousness and a little worldliness. Glory to God. A little Jesus and a little devil. Hallelujah. Mercy door is closing. Glory to God. And what will our answers be if we are not right with God? We have to make it right with God right here. Glory to God. Not later, but no. Today, if you hear his voice, harden not your heart. Glory to God. And just a matter what the church is like. The church has to go through. But one thing my Bible tell me, there is going to be a sinking in the church. Glory to God. God is going to sing the church. The wheat will be taken from the tears. Hallelujah. There will all be signs of sin. Glory to God. We love to examine one another. Let us look to ourselves. And let us examine ourselves. Young people, you are being targeted. And I see more than you.
Glory to God. Glory to God. And we are hiding. Church of God. What will we do when the trumpet is about to sound? Are we ready? Are we ready to hail him as our Lord and King? All he asks of us is to lay outside every weight and every sin. Every weight and every sin. That's so easy in the center. And he said, if my people, if my chosen people, the little tribe, who are called by my name, will just humble, pray, turn, see. God said, He's going to have mercy. He will forgive our sins. And He's going to heal our lives. Many people don't want the Holy Ghost today, but I tell you, those of you that don't have the Holy Ghost, get God in a sacrament and a kiss. Or those who go to bed and spread out and sleep and just snore till the end of life. No matter what you tell us, we are not for prayer. You should go to bed praying. And if we turn or turn, you'll call on God. Have mercy on the soul of Jesus. Have mercy upon the Lord. Hallelujah. 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 Because somebody was standing and waiting up one night to go and go and never go and fall into the sleep. And you know, we go for prayer. And sometimes when the trumpet sound is the Lord, they are in the sleep. They reach home. It will be the first resurrection. Come on, church of God. Lying. Stealing. Committing adultery. And think of all the various things that are separating us. We should not be where the holes are. We should be on the sheep. Amen. Glory to God. Glory to God. God, did I not show my tithes? God, I give my body to be burned. Lord, I come at every fasting. Lord, I make it possible to be at every night service. Lord, I am always in your home. Who are in the car, Lord? Well, depart from me. Depart from me. I know you not. Why? Because we did not measure up to be a God wants us to be. Are we looking into ourselves? The song said, I don't want not to hear. Neither me. From going there. Hallelujah. Mercy do is about to close. And what will our answer be? Hallelujah. The unsaved man know where they are going. They sign an agreement. You say, oh, you yeah, know, and you talk to some of them, so they don't be saved. Anything is anything. Can we the church say anything is anything? After we have made so many sacrifices, come on, people of God. Come on, children of God. You cannot say you did not hear. You cannot say, I did not have anybody to teach me or to tell me. No, you can't say that. Because once you have an ear to hear, let them hear what the Spirit said to the churches. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. When the book shall open wide, it is my name written me. I'm gonna ask myself the question: Is my name written me? Not your brother, not your husband, not your wife, not your children, not your grandparents. 
Lord will be set up. His fifth kingdom. Now is our father's kingdom. Now is our father's position. We are ready. It's our holding. Now is our holding kingdom. Because of the shift from PNB to PNB. To JNB and from JNB to PNB. Mercy rule. It's about to go. And we are the people of God. We are seeing the signs everywhere. And we are fulfilling all the purpose. So we must make it right to the Lord. Because soon and very soon, we're going to exchange this old rugged cross for a cross. We are going to be don't look for change in the Don't look for change at your workplace. Don't look for change in your home. Be the change. Don't look for change on the government. Don't look to the police force for the change. Look up. Look up. Right now it's a fifth look. And if you're not seeing clearly, let me tell you something. This earth is not going to be any better. The end of all things is the time because we have reached the final part of the healing that we can get for. We are higher than clay. We are not come together. And because higher than clay cannot come together, God Almighty is coming. To set up is everlasting kingdom. May God bless the church of God. May God keep the church of God. Keep your minds. Keep your hearts. Keep your bodies. Word. So I don't say time. I don't 
Father God, from our sinful state. And so, Lord God Almighty, this afternoon, as us, your children, I am setting up your words. I present, Lord, each and every one of us in your hands, the saved one and the unsaved ones. Father God, as they come to the heart of in full obedience. And Lord God Almighty, at this moment, I am asking your gracious God to remember us in your love and in your mercy. Father God, the unsaved ones, I'm asking you right now to trouble your minds. Father, that speak to them, Lord, whether in a dream or into a vision. Let them realize and know that they too are soul to be saved. You said in your words, my God, the apostle Paul declared, how shall we escape if we need to so great salvation? Father God, I present the unsaved ones in your hand. I'm asking the gracious God to do a divine work for them spiritually, physically, and every side. I'm asking the gracious God to remedy the condition that need to be remedied. And then the my God to step boldly from sin to grace. Eternal Father, remember the same one Lord, Lord put on your healing water and baptism. Keep your ten commandments. Try to walk in full obedience. Father God, you said it over a monument to your disciples that my grace is sufficient to keep you. Your grace is more than enough, Lord, to sustain us, your people. Father God, continue gracious God to give us courage. Help us, my God, to be courageous. Help us, my God, to be brave, to be bold. You said that you give us not a spirit of doubt and fear, but a spirit of love and of power. And of a sound mind. Bring us out of consciousness. Help us, my God, even to walk the walk according to your words. Father, let's take us out to that first place where we have first received you. Eternal God, we need another touch from your Lord, even to guide us on our journey home. Remember the woman servant. Give her strength. Give her fresh courage. Father God, continue, my God, to stand by your side. And as she continue to work in this part of the vineyard, then truly, my God, you will bless her. Father God, give it her, cover her under your efficacious blood, and continue, gracious Father, even to cause your face to shine upon her. Bless the entire congregation. Be with us, Almighty God, as I leave everyone entirely in your Father here. In Jesus' name I pray, and God's people say, Amen. 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 Our visions saw 
and not in vain. The vein was very wide and pretty. And uh, she saw a cat, and the cat was doing everything to destroy the vein. Then she asked the Lord in the dream, what needed this? And the Lord said to her, the veil is the church, and the cat is the devil, and none of the work will be outside of fasting and prayer. So if we take the church of fasting and prayer, we'll not be able to overcome that old child. So we said fast prayer. There's much to be done. And be steadfast. And there is a desolation uh, good evening, in Brendan. one day right now. And the only thing that can solve the problem.